What's up, everybody? It's your boy, the Vampire King himself, London VK, however, and this is maybe the final episode for the W2K24 My Rise Unleashed story with Dracula, the Vampire Queen. Let's get it, and I'll be eating a little bit. Someone's been busy, has she? I'd like to think I understood the assignment. <laughs> that you have, and it's still the tip of the iceberg. I have a fantastic opportunity for you. I'm listening. How would you like to try your hand at one of the most unique experiences in WWE? A position where you'll be able to set the agenda, take control of the whole of the WWE universe, Ooh. and truly make a mark. And this magical mystery opportunity will let me do all that? Indeed, in the prestigious role of WWE Raw General Manager. Mm. Isn't that you? What, are you going on vacation or something? Well, now that you mention it, <laughs> I may have plans. Aha! But this is fertile ground for you too. Stepping into a WWE authority role, applying your talents to the other side of sports entertainment. Sure, booking may be a balancing act sometimes, but you already know that from your work as co-owner of TBD. That's right. I'm not convinced that this offer isn't just because you want a vacation. <laughs> but nonetheless, I'll do it. Splendid. I can't wait to catch my flight. Um, uh, see you in action. So when do I start? Well, I should start heading to the airport. So, how's now? Seriously? All right. Don't worry. <clears throat> Raw practically GMs itself. Sure, Bianca needs a challenger for Survivor Series. Bailey and Becky have both been bothering me incessantly about their booking, and the suits in Stanford are especially sensitive to ratings right now. But you'll figure it out. All that GMs itself? Are you sure that's it? Yes. Oh, wait. No. Charlotte needs an opponent for tonight. <laughs> Actually, this is a good way for you to set the tone of how you'll be running Raw. Every match should tell a story, so you just need to decide which story you'd like to tell. Okay. Such as? Are you going to choose an up-and-comer like Nikita Lyons to challenge the Queen? Maybe someone she has a lot of history with, like Rhea Ripley. Or maybe you want to dig into Charlotte's past a bit further. She goes way back with Natalia, including the feud that made Charlotte the first woman to hold all major singles titles in WWE. So, what kind of story do you want to tell? Who will you choose to take on Charlotte? Nikita. I think Nikita Lyons would offer an interesting talent. challenge. I have no hard feelings, despite her involvement with the Beacon. And I like the idea of pushing an up-and-comer. Fantastic mm -hmm. choice. Well, good luck to you. I have every confidence. And just a word of advice. Do try to be as neutral as possible as GM. You may find yourself rooting for the talent you put forth. Sometimes even as strongly as if you were in the ring yourself. Mm. Okay, <clears throat> so So Jackie Laura is being GM. There's a new boss. Ooh, I like the post oh, let me get the good poster. Lion's Pride. The following contest is scheduled for one thought. Making her way to the ring from Las Vegas, Nevada. Nikita Lions. Ooh, 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 okay. Nikita Lyons, let's get it. Ooh. Attempt to defeat Charlotte. You missed. Ooh, suplex. Snap suplex. Ooh. 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 
Ooh, damn. Okay, Nakia. Ooh, 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 ooh. Combo. Oh, Charlie with the reversal. Oh, she's starting to go for them legs. Right, I'm cutting the worst out. All right. Nope, you thought. Now it's time for Nikita to come back, baby. Ooh! Uh-oh. Ooh. 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 Okay, Nakia. See what you got. Back suplex. So she got a clothesline. Psycho kick. Oh, 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 oh. Right, what's her finisher? Oh, it's spinning. Okay, okay. Get up, Charlotte. Drop kick. Ah, oh, okay. Charlotte, stop trying to do that. You're not gonna get it. But you will take this German or not. Question of the next week. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Back this. Lion Tamer. Here is your winner, Nakita Lions. Okay.
Okay, Nakia. No, I would say I would give her. There's a new boss on Monday Night Raw. I'll give her a shot against uh, Bianca. GM of Raw, did you do a career program? program, program? I'm still in ring competition, but there was an open opportunity. Dracula in that outfit. We got Troy, Shotzi, Justine. Oh gosh, let's go, Justine. I wanted to stop by and congratulate you on your new role. Okay. So, congrats. Thank you. It's only temporary while Regal does whatever he's doing on vacation, but thanks. And giving the key to Lions the chance against Charlotte, mm -hmm. and she pulled off a win. That was a great matchup. I know. Thank I love you. that you have a commitment to newer talent as GM. Oh yeah, of course. I actually feel the same way about pushing the next generation. Facts. Always have. And as your liaison to NXT, I wanted to offer you an opportunity. What's that? What's that? An opportunity to showcase more of our top talent on Raw in a next-gen battle royal. Ooh. And Nikita probably has a leg up from her match with Charlotte, but it'll be great for all talent involved to get the spotlight and some reps in. I love that idea. I'll set it up for our next episode. All right, battle royal. I'm okay with that. Shotzi, what's, what's up? Oh gosh, Shotzi, what do you want? I'm not here to fight. <laughs> Good. I don't want to fight either. Yeah. Then maybe we can work together on my idea. And what's that? Survivor Series. I know for a fact that not only has Raw not announced a main event, but Regal had nothing in the plans yet. So, let's take the bull by the horns and do something truly spectacular. War Games! Ooh. I can't just book a War Games match, Shotzi. Why not? Are you GM in name only? No, I mean, I love War Games as much as the next person. Mm -hmm. But it's not a match to be taken lightly. You need a reason. Something that merits putting two teams who want each other's throats inside a double ring cage to battle it out with a bandit. Who would even be the captains? I captained my team in NXT, and I was excellent. Ah, so this is the classic. My pitch is that I should be in a main event pitch, right? <laughs> there are rules to booking. <clears throat> Excuse me, but when did Little Miss TBD Rebel, who puts people through tables, become a lawful good rule follower? Don't you ever just want to smash things for the hell of it anymore? Uh, no. That's bad booking. That's not the point. I'm taking my role as GM seriously, Shotzi. It's hot shotting to just announce a War Games match. You sound like a WWE suit. Thank you. Let's screw with the so called rules. And that's where you Put at. yourself in the match against me, and we can absolutely destroy each other in that cage. We pick teams, go all out, and millions of people tune in to watch the joyful carnage. The two of us are perfect for war games. You're the captain, and I already drive a tank to the ring for crying out loud. You know what, Shotzi? It might not be a terrible idea. Let me think on it. That's all I'm asking for. Yeah, we're not going with your idea. Fuck your idea. Even though I want to war games, but it's like Dracula said. If I could have a minute. What do you want, Troy? <sighs> What is it, Troy? I honestly don't have time for your tone tonight. I'm trying to manage a show. My tone? I would never. Oh, use don't a that tone mean Troy's my sister Jackalore's sister? I think you're doing assistant. a great job, top notch. 
Ha ha, very funny. Oh, you're mm. serious. I guess now that I'm the management, you have to suck up to me. Yeah, I was about to say. I'm not sucking up. I think your ideas are genius, yeah, boss. You're sucking up, bro. I have faith in them, but that doesn't mean I'm not still nervous in this role. But what can I help you with? Yeah. yeah Becky and Bailey, they're being particularly difficult in hounding us to be named Bianca's next challenger at Survivor Series. Ah, I'm sure they snuck into your DMs too, but I'm used to superstars pestering us for opportunities. <laughs> no offense, but this is getting out of hand. Okay, so I can set up a one-on-one -on -one match between Bailey and Becky for the number one contender spot. How do you want me to handle it? Make a suggestion. Why don't we just have Becky and Bailey face each other for the title opportunity? That'll be a great match and solve our problem. Great suggestion, boss. I'll set it up. Wow, you really know your stuff. <sighs> I could get used to this version of you, Troy. <laughs> Book the match. Wait, do you get? Oh, uh, wait. Do you get other opportunities, or that's it? So that means I got for this episode of Raw a battle royal, and then next week we have Bailey versus Bailey versus Bianca. I mean, no, Bailey versus Bailey. Maybe that's a Bailey versus Bailey. Bailey versus Becky. I think it's a number one contender. Thought. And we got we got Thea Hill, Wendy Chu. I don't know. That was easy. Fallon 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 Henry. Okay, so. Yeah, he'll found him. You thought. <laughs> Get that booty bounce. Wendy, focus on somebody else. Okay, I guess I'll go to Thea. Get Wendy. You should get Wendy. Get Wendy. She's right. Bro. Fallon, you so stupid. I should punch you in the face. Thank you. 
Trump kick. Gotcha. Here is your winner. Nakina Lion. Okay. So then this will be a number one contender match for uh, Becky and Bailey for Bianca. <laughs> Come to congratulate me on a successful show. You're right. I was just out back talking to Justine about the successful battle royal. Yes, sir. So you didn't see the number one contender match with Becky and Bailey? No, that match practically booked itself. Why? Who won? Who are we putting against Bianca at Survivor Series? We have a problem. Damage control ran in during the match. And at first it looked like maybe a straightforward DQ victory for Becky. But then she got irked and went after them. And technically the bell rang at some point, but with all the fighting that broke out outside the ring, nobody really won. And we still need a challenger for Bianca. If I may make a meager suggestion, Survivor Series is right around the corner. You may just have to step up as GM and make it a decision. No, we still have one Raw left before Survivor Series. Let's do a rematch. Becky versus Bailey to determine Bianca's challenge. Let's put it in like a steel cage or something. Do you really think the match will go any differently this time around? Yes. I do. Because as much as it pains me to admit it, you're right about one thing. I need to step up as GM. So I'll be serving as special guest referee. Okay. All due to respects, was that Becky Bailey match? I mean, it was entertaining, man. Controversy is good, but Survivor is really soon. I know, I know. I'm already holding a rematch. I'm taking care of it. I'm even stepping in a special referee. Listen, I could tell you from the episode of Raw what match you really put your attention into. Fantasy booking without a solid build is fun, but you took your eye off the champ. You know, the person who puts butts in seat. I said, I know. I'm going to share a promo, a promo, a promotion secret. It's easy to do a job when you know what's ahead of you, as in who's challenging Bianca as a wrestler. How do I do that? Stop being all cold and innocent. You know how you said you're going to be the ref. Put your finger on, put your finger on the scale a bit. What do you want? I mean, who do you, I mean, who do you want to win? Who do you think would be a better against Becky? Please. I mean, at the PLE, get more people to watch. Um, Becky and Bailey. But Bailey and Bailey and Bianca, they have history. Bianca and Bianca and oh, well, but. They both got history with both of them. I mean, Becky. I mean, Bianca got history with both of them because of the whole Bailey with the whole damage control, and then Becky when Becky was big time Bex. So we're gonna go with Becky. Becky and Bianca do have some strong history. Well, there you have it. What are you coming to? Or come <clears throat> when are you coming to Raw? BTW. My invitation stands. To see you in the stripes next week, I'll be there. So what is it? I have to help Becky win? I mean, do I have to help Becky win? I hope not. Because that's not a good referee. Oh, you're probably going to play as Becky. Oh no, they probably gonna have to actually play this special referee. Oh snap, I'm actually the ref. Nice. Use a fast count to help Becky.
See, I feel like the game should let you decide. Get back in the ring. Come on, y'all. Solid ref, man. Come on, Becky. There you go. Ooh, nice drop kick. Go ahead, go flying. Flying! Becky going flying! Come on, y'all need to get back in the ring. Come on, get back in here, bro. Y'all need to get back in the ring. There you go. Bailey, do you want to tap? No. Chopped up the chop. Come on, Becky. Oh, they both got six. Who gonna win? Come on. That's a road break. God damn, how many moves do you got? That's two. Come on, Becky. Hey, get off the hair. Get off the hair.
Uh, I can't let you do that, baby. Yeah, there you go. Come on. Thank you. Okay, Becky. Okay, Becky. Come on, Becky. Oh, yeah. That's it. She got it. Yeah, Becky got it, bro. I ain't seen nothing. I ain't cheated or nothing. Yeah, I don't know what y'all talking about. I know Bailey about to be like, what the fuck? What was that? No, cool. I don't know what y'all talking about, bro. Yeah, I don't know what y'all talking about. What's up, Geneve? I did what you said. Even though I wanted to pick her. Well. That was something. I don't know what you're about. Hey, you were the one who said I should put my finger on the scale. Yeah, but I thought that and don't get caught part was implied. I wasn't actively trying to get caught. Too bad yeah. you don't have the chance to course correct the championship match before Survivor Series. So I maybe still can. I do. You can make a trip with her. Survivor Series is this weekend. You can't send Becky and Bailey back out there tonight for another rematch. No, but there's another option. As someone said recently, I'm Miss TBD Rebel, not a lawful good wool follower. And Raw is a three hour show. True. There's an announcement I need to make. All right, Miss TBD Rebel. Whatever you've got up your sleeve, good luck. Making a triple threat. Let's make it a triple threat. That's the best way to. S solve it is by making it a triple threat. Ooh, look at you in that red. As GM, I'm not deaf to the concerns of the WWE universe. Specifically, that my involvement in our number one contender match earlier tonight may have made it look like management was biased towards Becky Lynch. I assure you, my intent as GM is simply to put on the best show for the WWE Thanks. universe. And that applies to not just Ma, but Survivor Series. So we're gonna make it a triple threat. As such, it is my duty to inform you that Bianca Belair will not be defending the Women's World Championship huh? this weekend. Uh. She will not be defending this weekend because it's clear Bailey and Becky Lynch are not done yet. I just hope they have allies to rally to their side. Eight fighters, two teams of four. War games. Ooh. Whatever team wins gets the number one contender spot. Okay, we could do that. So you have them fight it out, and then whatever team wins. Wait, so wait, is Bianca? Um, so is Bianca? Yeah, I don't care what Shanti talking about. Crap. Becky Bailey. See what Bailey about to say. 
You really did it this time, didn't you, you dummy? I think you'd be happy that you're getting another opportunity to earn the title match in War Games. Yeah. Should have just booked the War Games match from the start, honestly. Want to be on my team? Why do you want me on your team? Right. I think it's pretty clear from your time as GM that you've been going into business for yourself here. Really and up. just doing whatever you can to scrape by. And that's exactly what I look for in damage control. Mm -hmm. So what do you say? Join me, Dakota, and Io in the fight to secure my WWE Women's World Championship match? I'll get back to you. I probably should be upset at you for putting another hurdle in front of my title match. But honestly... Fair play. Glad we're okay. We are. And I respect your hustle. You've made a lot of bold choices since coming to WWE. It's one of the reasons I want you to be on my War Games team. Really? I like your instincts. Especially when you get in trouble and have to think quickly on your feet. Heck, I even trust your instincts. Team with me, and I'll let you pick the rest of the War Games team. Uh, let me think about it. You let me pick? Oh, I'm not going to turn that down. Hey, I've been looking for you. I thought we were going to meet outside of catering. <laughs> Turns out I was pretty busy in here. Both Becky and Bailey want me to be on a war games team. You can't be serious. You lost this up so badly, and they both want you on their team? Mm -hmm. hmm. What can I say? I'm a catch. I swear, there's something in the water around here that <laughs> allows you to walk away from the consequences of your actions unscathed. <laughs> I'm sure putting yourself into the main event while you're also acting GM will be no different. <laughs> Thanks for another great promoter lecture. Look, I know you're gonna do it anyway. Who are you teaming with? I'm gonna team with Becky because Becky said I could pick the members. Becky said she'd let me pick Please the rest get of the team. I'm joining her side. Let Can't me wait for you to get absolutely no flack for putting yourself into the match that you set up. Have you decided who else you'll ask to join you and Becky? Thank you, game. I love you for that. Oh, so we got, we got, we got Melee Fan, Raquel Gonzalez, Alexa Bliss, Shotzi. I'm mean, gonna say Shotzi. Playing your personalized station. Damn it. Alexa, turn off. From Amazon Music. Alexa, turn off. We got Bliss. We got Shayna Baszler, Sonya Deville, Carmella. Natalia, Charlotte, Psycho Sally, Corche, Indy Hart, Piper, Selena, Candace, Zoe. I think it's the whole roster. Nikki, Lita, Jin, Tiffany, Chelsea, Trish, Justine. Hmm. Let's. Let's get a little crazy. So let's get a little. We need some strong muscle. And let's get a little psycho. Oh, wait, no. Well, good luck. I'm sure it'll be interesting. Right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for War Games. You hear it, ladies? So how do you know who got the advantage? Once all competitors have entered, Why shouldn't we be able to pick? Games officially begins. The match 
can be won by pinfall or submission. Exiting the cage will result in a forfeit. Now, let's go. Uh, who, who is this? Oh, I just seen Shanti and all of them sending so these Jackie Laura is starting first. Introducing first from Transylvania, Romania. So Jackie Laura is starting the cage first. I wish they would have had you let you pick if you want to be in the cage starting first or let somebody else start. Probably gonna go against Bailey first, probably. Oh, uh, yep. <laughs> damage, damage control. Or defeat damage control. Hopefully, we got that advantage since I'm a GM. The winner of the ropes. I mean, we got the lead. What the hell? Nope. Ooh, we got the lead. Nice. Three shot. Becky, get a weapon. Oh, you can take a control people? Nice. Oh, she get more weapons. My Dakota. Uh, it's on that teammate crap. I gotta turn it off.
Right, that, that makes sense, game. We dominating in this match. Raquel, uh, move out the way so I can grab a weapon. Oh, nice hard for Rana. Uh, I said Jackie Lara. I got help.
Look at my team dominating. No one's meaner than Tamina. Hey, look, we dominating. Look at here, we dominating. And once Tamina come in here, it's a rap city. Really protect your neck, cause if you don't protect your neck, you gon' get necked. Ah. We diving. Through the table, can we get it? Yo! Come on. Let's go. Becky, you got that number one contender. Congratulations. We just... Ooh. They got screenshots of people talking. Oh, I hope I got that screenshot. Good job, Becky. What the hell? You're getting fined for that, and you're getting suspended. We're fining her and suspending her for that. Driving a tank in there and smashing the number one contender. What the hell was Shotzi doing? I've had no problem with her. Yeah, I may have something to do with that. <laughs> Oops. Oops? I'm going to be out for months. Is that really all you have to say? No, she gonna get suspended. How about oops? I got carried away booking matches for forgetting to manage people. At least that seems to be the case based on what I've pieced together. You're back. 
I was having a splendid time communing with the blue-footed booby of the Galapagos. The who? But then, I caught wind of a few questionable developments. We should talk. I swear, I had it all under control. Sh uh, I watched we did. Shotzi crash a tank into the War Games cage. No, she getting fired for that. Fair point. And perhaps, even more egregiously, you announce War Games without me. <laughs> That's my thing. I announce it? War Games. He does do that. I'm sorry? Respectfully, you're fired from being Raw GM. I accept. It wasn't a question. All that being said, with our newly minted number one contender injured, we still need a challenger for Bianca. You know, what you've consistently failed to nail down. I hate rewarding you for this mess. But I'm a much better GM than you are, so I'm going to make the right choice for the show. And unfortunately, there's someone who helped lead her team to victory who's rightfully next in line for the opportunity. You'll be getting the championship match against Bianca Belair on the next Raw. Whoa. I, I was going to say we could do a number one contender spot with the three of us. Uh, with uh, Ra uh, Raquel and Psycho Sally. But hey, you... you Hey, you, you the boss. A world, a women's world championship. Dark Knight of Psycho. So I completed all of these. Well, you might have to come back to these ones. Okay. I mean, Shachi still needs to get that ass whooping. This is a good news, bad news kind of night. And I've always been a bad news first kind of girl. <laughs> so here goes. With our fearless leader, William Regal returned, looking quite tan, might I add. <laughs> the time has come for me to step down as your raw general manager. All right, so there may have been some mixed opinions on my stint as GM, but I'm sure that's only because we all know where I really belong, which is fighting in a WWE ring. That's right. Which is why I'm pleased to announce, given Becky's unfortunate medical status, at the hands of someone who William Regal has assured me will be dealt with, the real suits have decided to name a new number one contender for the Women's World Championship, me! And that championship match is happening right now! Oh wow, really? So, Bianca Belair, let's you knew you wasn't getting past Shotzi. You should be suspended. Hey there, friend. <sighs> Give it a rest, Shotzi. Haven't you done enough at this point? I think what you meant to say is, thank you for making me number one contender, Shotzi. Sorry you hurt your leg in that unfortunate tank incident. What's the way? you get hurt when you were driving the tank right is this really all because i didn't give you proper credit for your terribly original idea of let's have a war games match at survivor series and didn't even put me in the match you don't but deserve no, it this isn't an isolated incident this apparently is just what you do playing in other people's sandboxes 
stealing other people's ideas and jumping every line. What are you talking about? You may have William Regal fooled, but not me, and not the locker room. Oh, I'm sure, Shotzi. Cutting lines might work in TBD, but in WWE, there are consequences. Maybe that's what happened to you. She's behind you. Oh, so this. Bailey wants the works. All right, Bailey. So you want to get this work? Okay. I'll let you get the work, baby. You take this power bomb first. From jumping me behind. Let's go, baby. That's good. Back fist. Get up, baby. What's good? What's good, baby? Drop it. Come on, baby, what's the deal, yo? You're not doing nothing. Get that booty! I figured she was going to be something like that. Come on. What the hell? Hey, let's go. Hey, let's go. <laughs> she said, let's go. Shotzi, you just want the work. Just say it. Like I'm already, I already been wanting to get in the match. Reschedule. Does it look smaller? Huh? That's what kids always say when they come back home, right? They go off to the great wide world, come home, and everything looks Bigger? small. Oh. Haven't seen you around here much lately. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Maybe a little smaller? I was in the neighborhood. Figured I'd 
stop in to get a few reps in before my big match with Bianca? Shotzi's not also in the neighborhood, is she? <laughs> you know my insurance doesn't cover tanks. I don't think you have to worry. Tanks don't get great gas mileage, so she probably won't come crashing <coughs> through the wall. No promises, though. Right. And just when I was starting to feel nostalgic about you breaking things around here. How are you feeling after that crutch attack? I'm fine. Can you believe Shotzi's still bitter you didn't book her in TBD? And now she's turning it into a whole thing about how I stole her so-called war games idea. In fairness, it's you who didn't want to book her. What? Really? I believe your words at the time were, I'm not impressed. That does sound like me. But I was probably just being flippant. Being flippant without thinking that your actions could actually have consequences? Yeah, definitely you. Then, on purpose or not, Shotzi effectively brings you up to the big leagues, and instead of any sort of thanks, you steamroll right into a fantastical whirlwind tour of all things WWE. Let's be fair. I didn't steamroll right away. And Shotzi brought me to Raw so she could make an example of me. Facts. Maybe. But is that also why she pitched you the idea for a War Games match when you were GM? A match you thought was a good enough idea to book, but then shut her out of? I never said it was my idea. Besides, it wasn't a groundbreaking suggestion. And everything worked out. Right, because I'm sure the WWE Universe saw the superstar GM announce the War Games match, put herself in it, and then thought, hmm... Who else can I give credit to for setting up this awesome main event? Okay, Geneva, you... It worked out you... for you. And now you get a championship match against Bianca Belair. Shotzi? Not so much. Jeez. Whose side are you on, Geneva? Right. You know whose side I'm on. That's why I gotta be straight with you. To make sure you get your head right so you can take that title from Bianca. <sighs> you know, after ignoring WWE for so long... Becoming their champion is the only thing I can dream of. Hmm, it sounds like Geneva just be... I mean, but she do got a point there. She is... She's spitting facts, giving you heads. And it's probably not gonna be Bianca. Probably gonna be Shotzi again. Oh, of course. But I've, I've been wanting, I've been wondering. That's good. Let's let's get your ass in this room so you can get this work. Your leg is feeling good, I see. No, no, guys, guys. It's not what you think. I have a seriously heartwarming announcement. Bianca Belair can't be here tonight. So you gonna take her spot and get that ass open? I'm okay with that. No, I told you, it's actually heartwarming. Bianca was wrapping up an appearance at a nearby community center before the show when suddenly out of nowhere, three buses of adorable children from a local school showed up, excited to meet the women's world champion. And you know how Bianca is. She wouldn't leave until everyone got a picture and an autograph. How those buses showed up just in time to prevent Bianca from making it here for her championship match tonight we may never know. But Bianca just couldn't leave those sweet children hanging. So... Are you seriously booing children? So then why don't you get your ass in this ring? Wow. Yeah, look, see, what you and Jack, look. What thirsty bunch you all Get your ass in this ring and you can take this work. I did feel bad that you didn't have a match anymore tonight, So you, you won't bring your ass down here? Come on down. Oh, no. It's not me. I have the night off from in-ring action, just like at War Games. But these three women do not.
So it's a fatal four, but why do the hell all y'all come out here? Okay. Huh, you got that. Come on, Rhea. Rhea and Blood Air, are they play? Come on, real blood at Ripley. Come on, real blood at Ripley. Take a DDT. Come See, I hate when it does that. It's like, uh, hello? Mm. Nice. I was about to say you should get in there and get that. Asuka, you want some of the drop kicks, Asuka? Just let me know. I got you, Asuka. Pump kick. Oscar, get that. Thank you. I ain't getting hit with that. Fight that shit up, no. Oscar. Why are you trying to mess with me? Oof. You can't take this power bomb. Hit that oblivion on her though. Oh, 
Oh, Rhea got a finisher. Hit that riptide on somebody so I can take that pin. The hell is she doing? <laughs> what the hell was the whole purpose of that? Oh, fuck. Forget you, Liv. What the hell? Ooh, she tried. Protect your neck, cause if you don't protect your neck, you will get neck. Okay, let's start hitting some finishes on people. Ooh, she was oh nice. Got her into the rip time. Liv, get that. What the, what the hell was the purpose of that live? Damn. 
Lionel out. Come on. <laughs> I like how Liv just falls to the Signature. Hey, at least you let me go. No, I don't think I got ready for me. Oop, 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 oop. Oscar, focus on them. What the hell does you keep paying attention to me? Look, good thing she wasn't in inside the ropes, because I would have been done for it. All right, who getting in this ring, getting this work? Come on. I only need one of y'all in here. the ref out. Suplex. 
and dropper. Ooh. Good shit. Good shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Protect your neck, cause if you don't protect your neck, Oscar, you get neck. Oh, watch you taunting. Come on, Rev, come on. Oh my god, Rev, you took so damn long to do that, bro. You stuck, you stupid, stupid son of a gun. Oh my god, oh my god. I like how she hits a riptide now. Oscar, get that. Good shit. Oscar, why'd you leave the ropes for? Oh, I'm prettier. Oh, nope, not I'm prettier. Oh, right on top of the chair, too. Nice. Oblivion. Oh, she about to go for that oblivion. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, god. oh okay. Ooh, that's a cool move. Knee shot. Back this. Unless you had that one. You got that live. She said, I missed my flight. Shotzi, let's just have a one on one so I can whoop your ass. It was you, wasn't it? You're the reason I'm missing my championship match with Bianca. Again. Oh. It's hardly my fault. Your car service was way too willing to accommodate your new itinerary. You know, they really should have some sort of security on that. Figured the least I could do was play hooky from Raw 2 so we could have a little chat. You really want to do this here? Fight in an airport lounge? Absolutely not. They'd never let me back in and I love their little mini cupcakes too much. I just want what's mine. What exactly is that, Shotzi? I can't go back in time and hire you at TBD. I can't go back and put you in war games. Your obsession with me is unhealthy. What's unhealthy is theft. And I'm not just talking about war games. 
you may have gotten a free pass from Regal to waltz around WWE, ripping off other people's ideas, moves, and gear, but you didn't get a free pass from me. You're the number one contender. That should be me. Put it on the line in a match. Win or lose, we are done after that. Okay, fine. If it means never having to deal with your BS again, Bullshit. fine, you're on. But only because there's no way I lose. Mm, I don't feel like they're going to rickroll us. All right, let me loop your ass real quick and get this started. They might, but I don't know. Here we go, finally. I whoop your ass for all that bullshit you was putting me through. Back to this. Back to this. Get up, Shotzi, come on. Ooh, okay, there we go. That's what I like to see. Okay, okay. Nope. Stop. So I get you with that power bomb. Sit your ass down. First shot, sit Get you with another power bomb. Sit your ass down. Come here. Lay down with you. Get another one. You want to get up? Okay. Okay, okay. Mm. Come on, Shotzi, get up. You doing all that talking. Ooh, okay, you got that one. Nope. Ha, you thought. Come on, Shotzi. You doing all that talking. Now I came to the work, you ain't doing nothing. Come on, Shotzi. Ooh. You think I'm down too, bro? Tsunami! Oh, it must be a false color anyway that the ref just come up already. Shotzi, if you don't protect your neck, well, then you gonna get necked. Yeah. Ooh, you reversed it. Okay. Finisher must be in the corner. Shotzi, if you don't protect your neck, will you get in the neck?
Ooh, okay, Draco and Charlie. She said, I'm gonna get that shot, bro. You know what it really is. Now we got Shotzi out the. She's long gone. Now we can focus on a championship now. I feel like Becky gonna come back some way. Thanks for having my back out there. I was annoyed. Honestly, I think the whole WWE universe was. So, guess this means we're finally gonna get our match, huh? You're pretty excited for someone who's about to get handled. <laughs> you think? <laughs> I see how it is. Well, you just go ahead and underestimate me, Facts. champ. Oh, I don't underestimate you at all. I've seen your stuff on the indies. I know you can go, but so can I. You've watched my indie matches? I didn't know you'd be into that. What? Just because I started wrestling at WWE and never had an independent run doesn't mean I can't appreciate what you did there. I mean, that dive off the balcony against La Congrejita Loca? Wild. Self-destructive and probably ill-advised, oh, but wild. Checking out matches? Man, if you had ever been a free agent when I was in TBD, I would have gladly jumped off a balcony against you too. That sounds like a blast, except I'm the one who would have been doing the jumping. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy with how it came up, but I do sometimes wonder what an indie career would have been like for me. It sounds like an adventure. Huh. What? Just gets me thinking about our match. About whether I'm going to pin or submit you? No, well, not exactly. Someone recently pointed out that I was lucky enough to experience a fantastical whirlwind tour when I got to WWE. I got to have the adventure. I'm wondering if I should pay it forward. What do you have in mind? You're confident you're gonna beat me anyway, right? Anytime, any place. I was really hoping you'd say that. What the hell? Why? I'm guessing she's trying to do a war tour match or something. You want to do what? <laughs> it's just going to be two matches. Best of three series. So, yeah. I love it some best of three series. If Bianca really has no fight in her, Ooh, it'll Tokyo probably shit. go two. That's as many as I need. Mm. It's not the best of three series that gives me pause. It's the locales. It is the usual custom to defend the WWE Women's World Championship on WWE TV. Sure, we could do that if we want to stick with what's comfortable. Right. Or, get this, we fight for the Women's World Championship in the coolest indie arenas around. Ooh. Japan? Mexico, we could even go back to your old stomping grounds in the UK. Hey, I'm, I'm down for Honestly, ja Japan. Sounds like a great way Always to wanted that to go grass to Japan. Still international do. exposure. You business types Mexico, are always talking about. Mexico. And you know what and else the UK. it sounds like? Oh, I'm positive you'll tell me. It sounds like a big swing. It sounds like taking advantage of every opportunity on the table. And it sounds like doing something different without being afraid to fail. I know what you're getting at, and I'm not sure I like you turning my words back on me. <laughs> I'm sorry to interject, but... Oh, gosh. It's ridiculous. It's, it's unheard of. Allowing a WWE champion to defend at these underground indie shows? Untelevised? What about, 
What about the advertisers? Advertisers? Really? I'm afraid Troy makes an excellent point. Marketing will hate this. See? Fortunately, this is not a marketing company. This is a professional wrestling company. A professional wrestling company so you're doing is it? going to take a swing. And whose general manager cannot wait to get on the road. Uh, the only question is, where to first? Don't look at me. This is your world. I'm just the adventuring tourist who gets to hit you wherever you so choose. Mm. Face Bianca in the UK at the club. UK face. Let's go to Mexico. Mexico. I loved wrestling in Mexico, especially for this promotion called Lucha Magica. Sometimes they do shows in the middle of a town square. <laughs> You're going to love it. Except for when I beat you. That part will <gasps> suck. But the rest will be awesome. This is going to be so tough on your ego. Mexico sound good to you? Alert the crew to get their passports, Troy. We're taking it international. Let's go. We're going <coughs> international, baby. Ooh, I like the oh, so these are what they look like. Law, Japan, Lucha. First stop, let's go. Lucha Lida. Lucha. Ooh. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making our way to the ring from Transylvania, Romania. Dracula. All right, let's get it. Ooh, close on. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on, Dracula. Hit it with that back suplex. Come on, Bianca. Cutter. That's not what I'm gonna do, but I do not think I'm gonna die all the way over there. Ooh. Got her up. Ooh. Hit her with that power bomb. Sit down. Ooh. Oh, you wanna go for another one? Okay. Ooh. H bomb. Well, not really, but yeah. Check that booty. Ooh. I'll give you that. Crossbody. Uh oh. What's this? Ooh. Ooh, damn. Ain't that illegal? Damn.
Okay. Okay, we got the first one. Even though you cheated using your hair as a weapon. If I knew that, man, then we should have just made no weapons then. And you walking through the flames. Yeah, we don't need to Okay, we took a first L. Dracula took the first L. Dear, dear, dear. That cannot have gone as you'd hoped. No. Everything went exactly according to my plan of getting hit in the face a bunch. <laughs> Are you regretting giving Bianca the invitation into the Indies? Nope. Not at all. I miss the intimacy of a smaller show. The interaction with the fans. Just didn't expect Bianca to pull the same energy from the crowd quite as easily as she did. Bianca got very comfortable very quickly. It's okay. If she had come up in the Indies, I would have wanted her for TBD. But that's not going to stop me from beating her at her next stop. Which raises the question, where to next on this great tour of the world? Let's go to... Let's go to the Bianca mall. played a little fast and loose with the rules out there. So at our next stop, let's lay down the, the law. law. I'm sorry. The law. Law. L A W the Los Angeles, Los Angeles, Angeles promotion. wrestling promotion. Yeah. And those are seconds of my life I shall never recover. From city. The it city of angels it is. Come on, Bianca. You're gonna get that L this time. So we're probably gonna go to all four of them, basically. I'm gonna go to UK next. We don't need to watch it. Oh, they love you over here. Go get the upset on me this time. Practice. You gonna get that drop kick to the face? Can't let up, can't let up on it.
Can't let up on it. Protect your neck, Bianca, because if you don't, you will get necked. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Nope. Thanks, sweet. Pick her up. She kicked out of it. Okay, okay. Little bike! You ain't getting out of that. Get it. Second one, I me mean, a third one. Let's get it. Guess we are going to best of three. Let's get it. Ladies, it appears that you two will be going to a final match. Fitting, really. Winning that championship will be even sweeter after going the full series. Don't get cocky. No way you beating me twice in a row. Yeah, we'll see. Before you two launch into a witty repartee, I have an update. I've just spoken to the suits in Stamford. They have thoughts. Uh oh. Well, that's never good. Right. Word of your genuinely marvelous matches has spread, and so has the buzz. Ooh. They were insistent that the next match will be on WWE television. Okay. They want us to do the match on Raw? You promised us we could see this through in indie arenas. Indeed, I did, so I reached an agreement. We will be producing a portion of next week's Raw okay. live from the location of oh, your final cool. match. Oh, wow. Uh, listen, I know this is a stretch, but how would you both feel about having the match at T... TBD? Yes, a surprising and unexpected suggestion from you, which is why I have already I given like instructions Becky's for the road crew come back. to meet us there. Wow, it's gonna, it's be, some gonna be super embarrassing to lose on your home turf. But I, for one, oh, I should have Japan. Then. One idea, though. What's that? With everything I know about TBD, and since it's the final match, kind of seems like it should be no DQ, right? Fitting. Bianca Belair, you have no idea what you just asked for. <laughs> Deal. Geneva is gonna freak. Yeah, I feel like it's gonna be some shenanigans. He probably is going to win the title, but I feel like Becky's probably going to come back from injury. So I don't know if you pick Bailey, would it be the same story? While she's doing this, I'm going to go get a water. Wow. I'll second that wow. And raise you a hot damn. You really got to work in here, didn't they? Can you believe it? After the hectic morning I've had with the crew to get this set up, I can. I had to yell at some guy named Troy a lot. He kept wanting to cover up the TBD signage with Raw logos entirely. <laughs> Sounds like Troy. <sighs> I'm really glad that I could do this for you, Geneva. For us. Did you ever imagine that we'd be here? Honestly? You main eventing a TBD show feels pretty familiar to me. This one just has more logos. You know what I mean. This is different. Later tonight, 
I'm gonna win the WWE Women's World Championship in the house we built. Living the dream. Hey, you get ready. I've got some contracts to look at. <laughs> Same as always. But seriously, don't get too caught up in paperwork that you forget to enjoy yourself tonight. This is big. Big, big. I know. It is. And I won't. But I also know you'll enjoy this enough for the both of us. Good luck out there. I'm telling you, I feel like it's gonna be some shenanigans. Becky's gonna come back. Something's gonna happen. Introducing the challenger. From Trump. And there's no disqualification. Oh, you thought. Get off that roll up. <laughs> and that would have been something if she would have got her off that. Knee strike. <sighs> we gotta be careful. Alright, hello? Yeah. Alright, where you at right now? And the best of three series with Bianca. Uh, what, what match are you on? Uh, the last one. Okay, yeah, I just got done with that match. Ooh, close on. Alright, uh, I'll wait for you. Before, before I continue on. Cause we, we should probably end it here. After you're done with that match, we shouldn't we shouldn't have that much more to go. No, we're getting close to the end. Ooh. Now the question is if she's gonna stay up here and let me get her. Tsunami! Ah, oh, you had to get off the table, you bastard. Will you try to climb up to the top of the ladder? Jump off? No, I was trying to break it through the table. I'm gonna get it. Ooh, bicycle kick. Come on, Bianca, get back in the ring. Alright, give me a shotgun. I gotta take a I gotta use the bathroom. Ooh. I'll be back. About to get cheated. Do the table. If you don't protect your neck, Bianca, you gonna get nicked. Ooh. 
Lethal bite. I just want to get her off a roll up there. Alright, I'm back. Oh. Or you kick out? Yeah. Sure. Ooh, nice. Come on, EST, show me what you got. EST! EST! Wait for my buddy, guys. That's all we're doing. Get it done, and we're gonna uh, end it here. And we're gonna... Probably. I thought this was gonna be the last stream, but it kind of was not, so. I was trying not to last stream, last video. So. Clearly, it's not the last video. Cody got it! Oh, I love that move. Let's go. You got your title? Yep. But I feel like it's going to be some shenanigans. I feel like Becky's going to come back. You're coming back, eh? Hell yeah. Oh, way hard. No, 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 no. Uh oh, Geneva. Not in my ring. Ah, okay. I bet you I get it. What? It's going to be something with Becky, and I bet you Geneva is going to be part of it. You got WWE. And maybe, maybe not. Because this is the yeah, same storyline like how it was for uh, Baron Blade, where his he was the manager of your character, and he betrays you. If anyone, anyone <laughs> tries to interrupt my best friend's hard won moment, because Geneva been acting a little shady. It's gonna be me. Yep. You think so? Uh huh. Yep. I knew it. Because she was acting a little shady. She was acting a little shady. And what's the reason? What's the reason why? Tell us the reason, Geneva. Thanks for coming home, Cap. It was so generous for you to put this show together for me. I know you think I'm slumming it around here, but you forget that I'm proud of what we built together. And I know you're used to taking the credit for everything. So I thought it was important for me to make an appearance tonight. To set the record straight. You'd be nothing <laughs> without me. How else do we get you neighbor? Let me be clear. I am not just some best friend side character in your hero's journey. What do you think I've been doing since night? Sitting around and just following your career with rapt attention? No, what you should have been doing was crowning a new TBD I women's champion. That's what you should have been doing. And I've been putting eh. everything I hey, you know how it is. TBD. Mm. So, when Becky approached me, oh, Becky approached I was you. more mm. than happy to help turn your moment yeah. into <laughs> my moment. Mm -hmm. Now, now, the question I want to know is why is Becky hold my fucking title? Recognize this. The hey, language, but language. When we first started TBD, 
<laughs> she got that in a picture glass. I'm sweet. I had it framed. Or framed, my bad. Thought it was a nice touch. Yeah, that's the uh, napkin that's trying to remember. Yeah, I know. Because according to this legal. Shout out to be uh, beginning of the uh, storyline. Exclusively to TVD. Ah, okay. So you that means it's work for another else? promotion. You can't be mm. champion anywhere else. <laughs> Yeah, hey, but she was hey, the one I told okay. for a while. Hey, that's okay. You taking my women's world title from me? Or from Jackie Laura? But that means she's still TBD women's champion, bitch. <laughs> Not that she kicked you in the face, too. That's crazy. Yeah. Well, that's okay. At least she's still TBD women's champion, because it looks like you didn't crown nobody. Oh, TBD Wrestling Presents TBD Kid the Cap is back. Oh wow. Are <laughs> uh, you talking to uh Regal? About to now. Uh let me let me do my outro real quick. Uh at the end of the day and we'll start warming up and it should be done. Alright. Well, that didn't go quite like I thought it would. Yeah. No, it did not. What are we gonna do? So I, I don't even wanna hear all this because that's unfair. But we, I don't even care, bro. All right, y'all, we're going to stop here on episode seven. So maybe episode eight is the finals where we find out what happens with Jackie and Laura. If y'all enjoyed the video, make sure y'all bite that like button, bite that subscribe button, become a member of the Vamp Army. It's been your boy, the Vampire King himself, London Alucard. Check out my boy Hyperspeed. I'll have his video in the link description. And as being said, we's out here. Uh -huh.